Jake, how much have you thought about this? You know, this is a team that you haven't beaten yet. It's mm -hmm. hard to get eight plays freshman too. I mean, obviously it's an important game. You start to get this involved and you know, you cannot leave your career unless you get a victory against these guys. I mean, yeah, you know, I I've beaten them once my redshirt year, but I really don't count that. But uh, you know, all the seniors, we, we haven't beaten them yet. And uh, what a better way to to win than uh, to play for the Big Ten championship, play in our own place. And uh, they're they're a great team. And uh, um, you know, it, it's going to be a lot of fun. From a player's perspective, uh, does the hype and all the attention surrounding this rivalry game ever get you know, ridiculous for you guys? I mean, we we try to block it out. I mean, we. Really don't listen to the media or TV or nothing all all year, so uh, really don't do it now either. Is there anything to this idea that one team can get inside another team's head? Is it that in Columbus, Ohio State, mm -hmm. and they were really good in Michigan consistently? You guys have struggled. How do you uh, move that? I don't know. Uh, they they haven't gotten in our head. We just uh, we just haven't beaten them in a couple years, and uh, it means we just gotta. Go out, practice well, and and uh, it's it's a new year, new team. So uh, just go out and and try to get a win. What do you remember about that 0-3 game? Uh, I remember it was it was the hundredth game and just a lot of emotion, and it was uh, it was for the Big Ten championship. So um, it was it was a real emotional game, and it, it was a fun game to be a part of. Well, just when you look back, is yesterday any different than other Sundays during that eight game winning streak? No, not really. You know, it was uh, we were kind of disappointed that we lost, um, but you know, everybody was uh, um, after we got done finishing the film, correcting the film. Everybody was excited to uh, get back to work and start watching film in Ohio. How much do you bounce? How, how much do you use the mentality of having to bounce back after starting going to this week, having to bounce back after your loss against Wisconsin? I mean, we. I don't know. Like we, we're not even focused. Like we don't care what happened at the beginning of the season. We don't care what happened last week. You know, we wanted to be in the spot. We wanted to be playing for the Big Ten championship. Uh, we just got there a different way, and uh, you know, nothing me needs to be said. Uh, no one needs to be uh, get picked up or nothing. Uh, we're ready to go. Um, everybody's gonna gonna work hard this week, and uh, you know, we're playing for the Big Ten, so everybody is gonna be excited, ready to go, and, and they're gonna work hard. Uh, this year, yeah. um, uh, you know, there's just little things like uh, little technique things, um, some footwork sometimes, and using my hands every time in pass pro. I wanted to work on and uh, just p punishing people and uh, run blocking a little more. And uh, you know, you know, I felt I've done a good job and getting better at that this year. Maybe were you maybe more relying on physical ability in previous years, and you become combine the technical. No, I've always tried to uh, have the best technique I've, I can, and um, I've worked on it and gotten better every year at it. And, uh, you know, it was just the same this year. Um, I wasn't where I wanted to be yet, and I just kept improving on my technique. Jake, no matter how much film you watched over this game, can you almost count on them pulling out a few wrinkles? Is that part of this game that both teams have always saved a little something? Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm sure they have uh, stuff that they save for us, and, um, you know, we. Um, we just got to pick it up, uh, just play whatever they bring at us. And uh, now that's why you got to pick up the stuff you know it's going to come. And uh, so when they have little wrinkles, um, you know, you might be shocked at first, but then pick it up the next time. So I'm, I'm sure they got some stuff up their sleeve for us. Jake, what would you attribute the uh, reason that you guys are about to play for a Big Ten championship after that? Oh, um, I think the seniors on this team, the leaders, um, everybody really stepped up. Um, you know, seniors didn't want to go out that way, and nobody wanted to. And uh, they really stepped it up in practice, made sure we brought everybody else along, and uh, everybody was, was was really excited um, to start winning again. And uh, you know, we just really turned it around right there. You guys have said that in the past that Coach Carr is a little different during rivalry weeks, especially this one. Mm -hmm. Have you noticed anything yesterday? Um, you know, he seemed the same. You know, just uh, it, it, I'm excited about this week because there's always a lot of emotion, a lot of excitement at practice. Uh, you know, practices are hard, practices are exciting, and uh, you know, it's just a lot of emotion all week. And 
a lot of excitement. So it's going to be fun around the building and at the game. Do you have a feeling about Mike and Chad whether they'll be able to go this week? Um, I don't know. That's a question you'll have to ask coach. But, I mean, they, they're, they're looking good. And, uh, you know, they're ready to go. And, and I'm sure they'll do anything they can to be back on the field and play their last game. Um, Vernon Golston is, is a great end, uh, one of the best ends in the league, if not the best. Uh, he's strong, physical, fast guy. Um, you know, we played against him last year. Uh, their D line, um, they're, they're a great D line, great, great linebackers uh, with Lauren Itis back there. And um, they, they fly around, they can run fast, they're all physical, they're big, and uh, they're a great defense. Um, I mean, I don't know. I, I really don't think of it that way. Um, you know, I'm sure I will once um, I'm done playing here. But right now, I, I don't care what happened in the past. I don't care what my record is uh, against them. I just want to go out, play, focus on this game, and uh, and win this game. And I'm I'm not thinking about what happened in the past or my record. Jake, how much of you wants to win this game for Coach Carr? Um, I mean. A lot, you know. You, you always want to win for your coach, and uh, um, you know all the slack that he got at the beginning of the year and throughout the year. And uh, you know, people don't know, don't see behind closed doors how great of a coach he is, great of a person he is. And uh, you know, we just wanted to win all year for him. And uh, this game is big. Jason, how much of an adjustment has it been to, to have Adam move over and have Justin there? Did you sort of feel the difference at all? Uh, not really. I mean, we uh, we practice it and. and practice all the time. Uh, we did it through camp. Uh, every day it seems like someone on the line is playing a different spot. So uh, you, you get comfortable with different guys and yeah, it gets, a, yeah, it gets us, uh, us excited to see him, uh, all the emotion that he has and uh, how much he cares about us. So that's going to make us go out there and play harder and uh, make sure that we play our best and do everything we can. No, no, it's a it's a different team, different season, uh, different uh, just different atmosphere, and uh, we're not thinking about last year and uh, anything that was said or or the game or nothing. We're just focused on this year. I mean, I. I, I don't feel like I have to validate my decision for coming back. That was my decision, and, and I felt like I did the right one. And, uh, you know, that's not what this game is about. This game is about this team, about uh, this championship, and it's not about me. So I'm, I'm not even worried about that. Do you find it difficult to concentrate on anything else this week? I mean, is this absorbing? <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's, it's hard to focus on pretty much anything else but football this week. Uh, just so much that that goes into this game and this year and uh, for the championship. So it's it's hard to do anything else but football this week. It's been a pretty crazy year for college football starters. We have you guys losing to Appalachian State, but mm -hmm. here at the end of the Big Ten season, Michigan, Ohio State playing for the rights to the Rose Bowl, uh, sense of normalcy, everything back to normal. Uh, I mean, I guess, yeah. I mean, it, it seems. The five years I've been here, that this game has come down to Ohio State, Michigan for the Big Ten, and uh, for a chance to play at the Rose Bowl, and that's what it is this year again. So um, it's fun, and uh, it's where it should be. After the second game, did you honestly believe you'd be here? Oh, abs absolutely. I, I I had no doubt that we that we would be in this position. Um, you know, we just stumbled the first couple games, and uh, I, I knew that we could have a great team, and uh, um, I knew we were going to turn it around. And there's no doubt in my mind that we would be playing for the Big Ten championship.